The reason it's not true is because of what has to happen with unwinding. All right, so you're familiar with the fact that as people unwind, a lot of times their bodies go sideways. Right? You're familiar with that, right? Yes. Okay, thanks, Mark. So the reason they go sideways is thinking about weight. Where's the most weight in your body? Well, the lower down it is until you get below the pelvis, the more weight you have, right? You know, what's, what's up here inside a person's body? What's up here? Air, right, because lungs. What's in here? Water, okay? Water's a lot heavier than air. So it's, it's not just your body's smaller up here, than it is down here in general. It's there's air in here and there's water in here. All right? And you know, if you look, if you look, there's more weight, these vertebrae get bigger as you go down. So as the person starts to unwind, so you take uh, you take a body and the vertebrae, you know, one's over here. And then this one's sort of like that. And then this one goes a little bit this way. And then this one goes a little bit this way. And then this one goes, whoops. This one goes a lot this way. And then this one's on top of that one. And then this one goes the other way. All right. So if you're looking at a front view, all right, so there's all these, you know, you can see the pedicles and the vertebrae. So this is a front view. So in order to straighten out this bone, all right, you can't just shove this thing this way. You know, they have this mirror image adjusting where they take an x-ray and they, they say it's off to the left, so we're going to push it to the right. It's idiotic. And the reason it's idiotic is because, you know, people, people get upset when I use these words, all right? But they fit, sorry. Okay, and the reason it's idiotic is it's three-dimensional, okay? So if you take the side view, is that thing forward? Is that thing extended? Is it twisted? You know, what do you, what do you got? And then even on the front view, you know, if, if you have a vertebrae and you take an x-ray and it looks sort of like this, no rotation, right? That's pretty even, right? Because you have the vertebrae and you have the two pedicles that come out to the side, so they look like round things. But you take a vertebra, all right, and it looks like this, okay? Well, these things are offset to the side because that thing's rotated around, right? And this usually isn't in the middle. This would usually be more over here. That thing's rotated around. And so if this, if this thing is rotated around and tilted to the left, and they say, well, it's to the left, so we're going to fix it, right? But it might be twisted to the left and they need to push it to the right. And that, all right, that works out mirroring. But what if it's going this way and it's twisted to the right, even though it's tilted to the left? See, if it's twisted to the right and tilted to the left, if you push it to the right, you're making it worse. So this whole mirror image adjusting thing or mirror image treatment thing is silly. It's beyond silly. It's idiotic. Because right? it's too simplistic.